There are a lot of barbecue products out there on the market. Some of them are really cheap, some of them are really expensive. But when it comes to barbecue accessories, a lot of them I have found have been very expensive for very simple things. Well, today I'm gonna show you some of my top picks and some incredible savings you can get on Timu by downloading the app on your cell phone. There's also a discount code I'll have in the description down below. Make sure you check that out because you're gonna save up to 90% on a bunch of items and you'll get a $100 bundle as well as a first time Timu user. So let's go ahead and check this out and I'm gonna show you some cool things and I'll have all the descriptions down below. This video is sponsored by Timu. Thank you so much for sponsoring Ukulele J Barbecue. Timu is a great supporter and has offered me the opportunity to pick out a lot of the things that I liked so that I can actually do a review on these items and show you the incredible value and the same things you see on other stores for a whole lot more. So let's go ahead and get started and I'm gonna show you our first item. Now the first thing is outside atmosphere. Whenever I barbecue, especially in the evenings, everybody hangs the lights or they wanna have candles. And I found something that's not only fire safe if you live up in the mountains like I'm doing now, but it's really convenient. It has a USB chargeable and you can actually light it upside down or right side up. What am I talking about? I'm talking about this light. Each one of these flickering candle lanterns is only nine bucks. Now I got a whole set of these and this is one. Each one comes with a remote. So if you buy six, you're gonna get six remotes. I put five away. If this ever breaks or the battery goes dead and you don't wanna mess with changing the battery, just grab another remote. It's really simple. So with this, you can actually hit the on button and you have an incredible realistic looking flame. And this thing looks absolutely fantastic. It really is cool. And if you hang it, there's a magnet as well. It works both ways upside down. You're gonna notice the light changes and it shows it flickering up. So it's kind of like a magic trick, but it's really cool. The other thing is you can actually hit the light and make it just a light. You can actually go to flame, make it a flame, and you can also go to breathing where the light increases and decreases slowly. But I like the flame. I think that's really cool. Now, the one thing I love and I use all the time, and you probably do too, are tongs. And I'm talking about barbecue tongs. Now, there's actually barbecue picks where you can actually hook the meat and turn it over. But there's also things that are more delicate that you want to get with some dexterity that with these sometimes is a little bit of a challenge. And we'll talk about these in a second. But I found this really cool tong, and I've been looking for these, has a protector on it. They're really narrow, and they're really good for highly accurate things. It's really cool to pick up small things such as this, and you can turn it over without rubbing off all of your rub or marking up your food, which a lot of people don't want to do for aesthetic sake. But these are really cool. The other thing that I like about these is they are really firm, so you can grab easily. They bounce back. has a really nice coating on this to prevent these things from heating up, and I think they're absolutely an incredible value. And you can't go wrong for three bucks. Let's go on to the next item. Now, when you're grilling, you have to be careful, especially over charcoal or open fire, that you don't burn your hand. And a lot of times when you get close to that grill, even the heat that comes off that radiating from the grill tends to get your hand overly hot. Sometimes it can even burn you if it's a really big raging fire or a large coal supply. This thing is fantastic. You've seen these before and you can't beat this for $6.99. And this is an incredible deal. And again, the prices may change, but as of this filming, you can get each one of these gloves for $6.99 or 14 bucks for a pair. They really work well. They've got a non-slip surface on them and I've used them several times and it goes all the way up into your forearm and really gives you a lot of protection. It's a great little glove. Next are these tongs. There's an eight, 11 and a 13 inch tong. You get the set of three. And these are fantastic. You've all seen these. They have them on all the big box stores and online stores. These are the ones that are locking, which I love. You actually push them in and they actually lock. They're spring loaded and they also don't really melt. I've used them on very high heat and the silicone tips on these things are really, really nice. So you've got the small one, you've got the medium one. Again, you push it in and these are the locking tongs, which I think are fantastic. And I would highly recommend these. And you won't believe the price on these, $1.94. I mean, come on, can you get a better deal? Next up is the meat tenderizer tool. This thing is absolutely fantastic. It's a marinator and a tenderizer. You can basically lift this out, fill it up with the marinade, just like I show you here. And when you're done, you can wash it, close this up, and it's absolutely fantastic. It has a locking mechanism. You can put this position in the lock position. You can put it in halfway mode, which lets you push this down halfway, or you can turn it to full mode, which lets you push these all the way down in the meat, 
which is pretty far, so I've never really had to use this beyond halfway. Or you could use it as a tenderizer and tenderize your meat and not have to worry about doing the marinade injection. But it is a really cool combo tool that I've found very useful, especially on things such as a really large tomahawk steak or a big thick pork chop or any type of meat that is super thick. And it's gonna run you about 12 bucks. Next is an essential tool that I use all the time. That's my poultry shears. I use it for meat, I use it for poultry, breaking bones, cutting open bags, and this thing is fantastic. It comes with an actually hard cover, which is pretty cool, and they're really cool. Look at these. Just love the look of these things. They are super, super slick. They're really tight, and you have no problems cutting with these. It's got an ergonomic handle. It's kind of a soft material in here, and these things are really strong, and you can use them to cut just about anything. There's actually a very slight serration right here, that's just enough to really give it that extra cutting power. I think these are incredible value. And I got two of these for four bucks. Next is my collapsible cutting board colander. This thing is really amazing. I've seen these before and they were really just too expensive to get. But with this, you actually have your colander that you can lift up really high and you can fill this up for cleaning things. You can use fruits and vegetables in here and it's got a drain that you press down and it drains it out the back. If you're gonna go ahead and prepare any meat or vegetables, you can also convert this to a cutting board, push this down, and now you can use this as a cutting board. It's really convenient, it's really small, it's super light. It's definitely water resistant because when you pour water in there, it hasn't come out. So that's a really nice thing when you're on a counter and not have to worry about leaking all over the place. Very convenient, and you've seen this for a lot of money, but this one was under nine bucks. Absolutely fantastic value. Next up, and probably the number one tool in my kitchen is the oil sprayer. I absolutely love these things. When I cook, I try not to use a ton of oil and it's sometimes hard to control oil when you're pouring it out of the jar. This is a sprayer and it works really, really well. Take a look at this video and I'm gonna show you how it sprays in a pan. But this thing's fantastic. I've had this for a while now. It does not clog. It is super easy to refill. Screw it off, it's glass, which is really nice, not plastic. You just put your oil in there, close it back up and you're good to go. And if you wanna fill something up and you're running out rather than unscrewing it, you can hit this button right here. And now you can pour stuff in there with a funnel. Or if you're accurate, you still can pour things right in there and mix it up. So if you have a bunch of oil, you wanna add some balsamic vinegar, you can go ahead and do that after the fact. Really convenient, mix it up, and then you can use it for putting on salads. You can use it for your meat outside. If you like to spritz, I'm actually no spritz, no mustard guy, but hey, if you wanna spritz, you can use this to spritz your brisket your steaks, whatever you want to spritz, you can go to town, but I love this for oil. It is designed as an oil spritzer, and I think you really, really like it. And this was around three bucks. <laughs> you can't really beat it. Next up is the barbecue blower. This thing is so cheap, but it is so efficient, and I don't know how many times I've started charcoal, I've been in a rush, and it wasn't quite all ashed over, and I said, you know, I need something to really get this going. I'm either blowing on it, or I'm trying to fan it, and get it going, but this thing is wicked. Listen. It's like a turbocharge. Check out this video and you'll see me using it here on a video that I did recently and it really gets the charcoal going. It's really simple, it's got a nice gearing on it. You just crank it up and watch the fire come on this. You see the flames there? Absolutely incredible. It's only a couple bucks on Timu. You definitely gotta check it out because this thing is definitely invaluable when it comes to starting your charcoal. And this thing's an incredible value. I think I got it for about $3.50. You just have to snap on this one handle and it's good to go. And it works absolutely fantastic. Now, you may say, what is a welding torch head and why would you use it in barbecue? I use this to start all my fires. You can spend tons of money and buy these really expensive jets that you know look kind of cool through a fire coming out. You're spending a ton, I mean hundreds of dollars, if not well over $100 for these things. And this is all you need. This is solid brass, solid metal. It is not plastic and it comes with a tip you can take on or off. Again, this is all solid, uh, nice brass components on this. It has the on and off valve for the gas, which is really buttery smooth, which I like. And it has a lock on top so you can actually lock it open when you start it. Now the thing about this is it uses a standard one pound propane tank and I have a refillable one right here that I just refilled. This does not come included. This is something you have to get separately, but it goes with this. And you can also put a 20 pound tank on this if you want with a hose, but I do this for convenience. So that way you don't have to worry about a hose. And once this is on, this thing is a torch like no other. So we make sure it's secure, 
turn this on so you can hear it going. We'll give it a little flip. And that, my friends, is serious fire. It's super hot. It'll get any of your charcoal lit in just a matter of a minute or so. And the price fluctuates, especially if you want to get the brass one. There are other models on there that are less expensive. I chose for the one that was more expensive, solid brass, because this thing is going to last a long time and it's outside all the time. So I went for the more expensive version. You can pick whatever you like. Now this next device is probably the most fun, coolest device that I use outside and I love it. It is a Piezo Ignition triple burner camping stove. Comes with a case, really nice, hard plastic. It's got the cable with it and this fits on the little tiny camping butane stoves. But what you can do is I bought an adapter that is not part of the kit, but I bought the adapter because I want to show you how cool this is. We'll take this on with the adapter. We're going to put this on here and I'm telling you, this is like a rocket ship and I'm not kidding. What's really cool about this is the compact nature. These have feet that actually open up and they swivel down. So you pull this out like so, swivel this down, do that on each one like so, and they go all the way out if you want, or you can actually do it halfway, but I recommend open them up to the full position, get the feet down, and this thing is ready to rock and roll. Check this out. The piezo ignition is right down here. That's the piezo igniter. And what you do is I start out slow with this. This is the gas knob on here. I'm gonna open the gas and you'll hear it just so it starts hissing. And I don't know if you can see it, but this thing's hot and check this out. Oh yeah. <laughs> now remember to get this incredible deal, go ahead and scan this QR code right here. And also check the link down below. There's a discount code and you'll get a hundred dollar bundle and up to 90% off on your first purchases when you download the app and you are a first new user. Don't miss out because this is an incredible deal. You saw on the video today, all the products, and there are hundreds more that you can choose from, including quantities, colors, and everything you need for your kitchen and barbecue accessories. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, share this, and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Smoke on, baby! Yeah.